Thank you. Most children ask for presents under the tree and overstuffed stockings. But while some families are putting up lights and building gingerbread houses, one little boy here in El Paso told ABC 7's Krista Mack his holiday wish can't be found under the tree. Here's Krista with this touching story. It doesn't let me run. It doesn't let me sleep properly. And it's just tiring with this backpack on. Only helps me stay alive. 12-year-old Asael Villa, a fifth grader, is in need of a kidney transplant. His mom, Clara, says he is her main priority since day one. So this was something that was diagnosed from the moment I was pregnant with him. At just two years old, Asael underwent his first transplant. Now, at 12, Asael is facing full-time dialysis. Oh, there's, there's a lot of thoughts. Uh, it's hard. Sometimes... I count my blessings. Asael has many hopes and dreams for his future, just like any other 12-year-old boy. Isn't that right? Mm-hmm. Found it. Boom. <laughs> Nothing stops Asael. He loves to paint, play video games, and one day be a chef. He even taught me a thing or two in the kitchen. <laughs> and Brian Martindale, executive director of the nonprofit Kidneys for Kids, is on a mission to find living donors. Hi, Krista. Brian, a living kidney donor himself, is passionate about spreading this message. This summer, I drove 7,000 miles uh, as part of recruiting 100 kidney donors for 100 children. Hey, you know, how are you? After meeting for the first time with this story, well, Brian now has another reason to drive. All better and free from dialysis. And that's exactly what Asael wishes for Christmas. I wish for a kidney donor. Krista Mack, ABC7.